Welcome to Electron Online. When the denominators are not prime numbers, then look carefully and see if the largest of the denominators is a multiple of all the other denominators. Because if it is, that simply becomes the lowest common denominator. Here we have an example, 1 fifth plus 3 tenths. 5 goes evenly into 10, 10 being the largest denominator. Therefore, the LCD, the lowest common denominator, is simply equal to 10. Here again, you can see that 1 over 3 plus 1 over 15. 3 goes evenly into 15. 15, therefore, is a multiple of the other denominator. The LCD simply becomes 15. And here, even when we have three or more fractions, again, look at the largest denominator and notice that both 4 and 8, the other two denominators, fit evenly into the largest one, which means that 32 also becomes the lowest common denominator. Now, that was the easiest video of them all, wasn't it? But again, you need to be careful. Look at all the denominators. If the largest one is a multiple of all the other denominators, that simply becomes the lowest common denominator. And that's how it's done.